Welcome everybody, Dustin Williams here for Digilog. Corey, the Cold Spring Springers set to do battle against the Sodderville Outlaws from Wintercrest Park in Coon Rapids. We pick up in the first inning with Zach Femright on the mound. He would strike out two in the first inning. In a game when the Springers really needed him to come up big, he was there to answer the call. We move ahead to the second inning, third strikeout for Femright. As he ends the inning, 0-0 would be your score after one and a half from Wintercrest Park. Bottom two we go with Ben Griffin at the plate. The Sodderville center fielder is going to make a great diving catch to rob Griffin of a single. It would be a big play as you'll see a sharp ground ball by Rick Burtzel off the shortstop's glove. Ryan Holthouse is going to try to come in and score but he would be gunned down at the plate and little did the Springers know how big that run could have been as this game was a back and forth pitcher's duel the entire game. Femright with strikeout number four on the day and quickly gets strikeout number five. Five strikeouts through three innings for Femright. Here, strikeout six and seven in the fourth inning. And Femright was cruising. Here, a pop fly ball coming right at us. His first baseman, Darren Hang. He would make a nice running catch right up against the fence in foul territory. Still tied 0-0. Strikeout number eight now for Femright. And strikeout number nine. Is midway through the fifth inning, we're still tied at zeros. Here Rick Burtzel is going to come up with a nice inside out swing and get one of the few hits for the Springers in the bottom half of the fifth. Another hit here by Brian Hansen and the Springers have something going in the fifth. However, Tyler Horning would strike out, stranding two runners on base for the Springers and at the end of five, it's 0-0. Zero, zero. Top six we go. Zach Femright would get the first Sodderville batter to strike out on three pitches. His Holthouse guns him out at first base. The runner trying to reach here. The next batter would strike out on four pitches. And later in the inning, he would strike out another batter. However, this time he would reach base on the wild pitch. But Femright would get his fourth strikeout of the inning and end the mild threat for the Sodderville Outlaws, his 13th strikeout through six innings for the Springers. The bats still couldn't get going for the Springers in the bottom of the six, and Sodderville would have their biggest threat in the game as they would get three men to reach in the top half of the seventh, but once again, Zach Femright was brilliant when he needed to be, striking out the last batter of the inning, the Springers get out of a jam, still tied 0-0 at the end of 6.5 from Wintercrest Park. Scary moment for the Springers in the 10th inning. As Zach Femright gets a little wild, he would bean the Sauterville player right in the head. However, the player would be okay. He would remain in the game. The coaching staff in the infield wants to talk it over with Femright, see if he's got enough juice still left in the tank in the 10th inning. Here, a strikeout on three pitches for Femright. So he gets the next batter out, a key strikeout. So he would not like the call, but the call would stand. And eventually, Femright would go on to strike out 21 Sauterville Outlaw batters in this game. That's right, 21 batters in a 10-inning shutout game for Zach Femright of the Springers. Here, he'll get the last batter to strike out with two men on. He is pumped up. The Springers will come up to bat in the bottom of the 10th with a chance to walk off and win the game. Here Rick Burtzel at the plate is going to lead off with a hit down the right field line. He would try to slide into second base ahead of the throw, but he's called out on a quick bang-bang play. He can't believe it, but the ump would call him out. After a Brian Hansen double, he's going to come around to score with two outs in the inning, and the Springers would get the walk-off win one to nothing behind Zach Femright and his 21 strikeouts. 